Yo, what's going on guys, it's Akatix here. Finally bringing you guys the results for my 500 subscriber contest on my new channel. And uh, so first of all, I just want to thank you guys so much because there was a really overwhelming uh, amount of entries. I actually got over 115 entries, which is epic. So it really shows that you guys are active and uh, want to participate in these, which means I will be doing more. So, I want to say thank you guys for entering, there were some really great entries, extremely difficult to pick the winners, but the choice was made entirely by me, so if you're mad, be mad, but I think that the people who won really deserved it because I was looking for originality, and since there were so many entries, uh, I decided to do three different ratings for the honorable mentions, meaning three star, four star, and five star uh, HMs. Five star being the ones closest to getting a position, but like very nearly missed out. And then we have our top three. So going into our three star honorable mentions, my first one is LCB. And uh, overall, it's a very simple background, but I really like the originality and it was the Cinema 4D loading screen with uh, Akatix on it, and it just seemed pretty cool. Nice design, very plain, but though I, if, uh, there, if there had been a bit more, maybe not texture, but some materials in the back, uh, or some uh, 2D designs, you know, stuff like that, just to give it a bit more texture in the back, that would have been better. But other than that, thank you for entering. Next up, we have So Cut. I'm not sure how to pronounce that but he did two entries and uh, I really like this one is pretty cool material on the text and I like how you use my logo for the text as well so it turned out to look pretty cool thank you so cut and a third our third honorable mention for three stars is OG and uh, you can't really tell from the video but it's pretty cool uh, banner the materials that he used Look very nice, especially behind the text. So overall, very nice background. I think that you should just work a bit on your blending, especially on your your backing of your banner. But other than that, it was a very solid background. So moving on to the four stars. First one we have Josh or Jack. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that. But once again, I was looking for originality, and uh, he brought it with uh, this. And now I wasn't entirely sure. I didn't watch the speed art because there were too many, but. Uh, I'm not sure if that was a Cinema 4D or a stock behind the logo, but either way, <clears throat> excuse me, it looks very, very nice and uh, has a very nice appeal to it. So definitely keep working on that style, but you should make sure you uh, also work on the blending a bit because it just looks like some of the parts of the, what's behind the logo is just fading into nothing, which doesn't make it look as good. So moving on, we have Wendigo or Wendigo. And this was a very clean design, and it has barely anything to it, but it's such a clean design that I chose to uh, make it an honorable mention because it's a very clean piece, and I really like the overall look. So congratulations on honorable mention, Wendigo. And then we have Ed Soul. Thanks, thanks. And this was extremely... I've never seen a background like this before. It was very unique. And once again, that's what I was looking for in this contest. I was looking for unique pieces, and that's exactly what Ed Soul did. So congratulations on your honorable mention. Moving on to our five stars, and these were the runner-ups for the... or very close to, to getting the top three. We have Subliminal and my good man Sub. He did two very sick entries. Really like them both. Uh, his cell style, or... I can't, I forget what it's called, like the toxic style or virus style or whatever. It didn't turn out as well as his other banners. I felt like the logo was a bit too bright, but other than that, it looked great. And his other banner, which is on the left side, uh, that was a really sick material and the overall looked great. But uh, I, I don't know what else to say. It was good, but thank you for entering. So next up, we've got Zero. My homie Zero, he's got a very nice background here. The only thing that sort of threw off uh, this banner was the text on the logo. I don't know. I didn't think it matched the style too well. But uh, other than that, very sick material. I love the way the logo is positioned and the blending is perfect. So congratulations. And now for the third and final five star HM, we have Ragdoll FX. And he did a very sick 
intro for me, and he actually made two variations because the first one I had a bit of a complaint on it, but it was absolutely sick, and so now it's going to be playing, uh, or it has been playing for a while now, and uh, so very, very good modeling, really like the lighting, the textures, the CC, everything was really good, uh, so congratulations, and by the way, also, uh, Soda entered, and he did also another sick intro. So both of you guys were technically in the five stars, and uh, so as a result, since you guys both did really sick intros but didn't make it to the top three, you guys are both gonna get a free banner. So yeah, and uh, now we're done with the honorable mentions. Actually, no wait, there's one more in the five star which didn't fit, and that was Cow. He did a pretty sick entry and uh, looked really good too. But now let's move on to the top three. So moving into third place. We have Kai, uh, who did a 2D banner, and this was really sick. Like, I, I enjoy, uh, I really like the paint splatters, uh, something that I've used a lot in the past. Very, like, clean text, the font is perfect for this, the bulge, the, the distortion, everything is uh, right on the point. So, very nice entry, congratulations on third place, Kai. Moving on to second place. We have Time Cries, and he did another sick entry, and this is something that's uh, becoming a very popular style, but I think this one turned out a very, very nice, uh, very nice text and everything. The only thing that I would suggest to you, Time Cries, is not to put your the title of the banner, so where it says Actix Designed by Time Cries. I wouldn't put it there, because that sort of gets in the way of the whole banner, so I would put it somewhere on the side, and uh, yeah, make it a bit more subtle. Just to make it part of the background, but don't make it stand out too much. So other than that, very nice entry. Congratulations on second place, Time Cries. Moving on to first place, we have Blur Art. And this is exactly what I was looking for, originality. Now, this is a very simple background because essentially all I could see is the render and uh, some bubbles, the shark light source on top and then just duplicates of the render to make it look like it's fading out and that was perfect like this banner is exactly what I was looking for the originality is spot on uh, overall really great looking banner I really like the uh, texture that's on the logo as well as uh, what's around it and I think that adding the shark like that which actually looks very realistic and part of the banner uh, it, it just made it a winning banner. So there you go guys, there is my, finally, my results for the contest. Hopefully you guys agree with my choices and even if you don't, I'd appreciate it if you wouldn't leave a dislike because, you know, showing bad support on these videos means that I won't be doing any more contests. So yeah, congratulate the winners, congratulations to everybody, thank you so much for entering once again. And uh, by the way, sorry for the inactivity, I was just on spring break enjoying my vacation. So I'm going to get back to the whole uploading scene very soon. So yeah, peace out guys and stay sexy.